when you go to take your meat samples, make sure you take a sample from different areas of the tray. That way you get an even result. Once you have your meat samples from different areas of the tray, you can pack it into the holder. until it comes out on both sides and then swivel this around to cut all the excess off. Once you've measured your amount of meat you can use your pinky to push out the sample. You're then going to put the sample inside of the cartridge. When you place the vial in the machine, make sure you use the dial to keep pressure on it. We're now ready to turn the machine on. You're going to let it run until no more liquid comes out of the cartridge. Now that the machine has stopped dripping, we can turn it off and we can move on to measuring our liquid. When measuring the liquid, you're going to be measuring the clear or fat liquid. First step is loosen the screw so that you can raise the lower jaw to the bottom of the fat. Tighten your screw. Now using the dial, lower the upper jaw to the top of the liquid. To ensure accuracy, make sure you are at eye level when setting the upper and lower jaw. Once they're both set, you can read your number across right here. Whatever number you get, subtract that from 100 and that will give you your percentage of lean meat.